Good morning Turkey. It is so nice to be here. I fully rested. Yesterday man, I was so damn tired, but um, I've rested up. I've rested up well. I've rested up well. I've got a bit of a trip today and this is sort of west of Istanbul and I am looking forward to just getting on a plane again and heading to the coast today. So let's go. Um, I'm looking forward to this. Uh, here we go. I think uh I think cheese might be a problem. Take a look at this. It is so stunning, so beautiful. Welcome to Bodrum. Bodrum is a beautiful city right on the Bodrum Peninsula, around the coast, right into the Aegean Sea. I wanted to come here to see the blue waters, the calmness, and just for some relaxing time. So here we are, welcome to Bodrum. I've got some exploring to do and I need to go and see more. I'm going to go and do that today. So my first day here, I got here last night, but I'm ready to begin my time here. I'm well rested, so I'm ready for my trip. And while I've been taking in all of the sights, I've been walking around everywhere, I've been making my own time and just enjoying my time here. It is so stunningly beautiful. So out in the distance here is where I'm going right now and this morning I took the drone up over there. How do we get down there? It's just beautiful, really. Uh, let's just figure out where to go here, follow the path. Wait, here. As usual, I'm a New Zealander, so I've got my jandals, which um, in American sense, flip-flops. <laughs> so we go down here. And next time I'll bring some proper walking shoes. So don't take that as a recommendation. Please don't. Don't bring flip-flops, sandals when you're walking down here. <laughs> oh man, look at that water. It's just, it's stunning. It's so nice and blue. Man, I was looking for this. I was looking for this water. Finally found it. I finally found it. No regrets. Even though the walk's been a bit of a hike. No regrets. Watch out over this side. Avoid the obstacles going through. Avoid the old house. Um, let's figure out how to get around here. I'm trying to get all the way to that blue, the blue water over there. I hope I, I hope I won't be putting this in the entire trek in the, into the video. That's not really fair. I need to make things happen fast. But we're almost there. I swear, we're almost there. So I finally made it down to my own little private beach. I can't name this beach because it's probably got a name, so I won't. Uh, but <laughs> there's no one else here. It's so quiet. There's no one else here. I'm just literally just here at my own little private beach, just probably for a five, 10 minutes until somebody will come by. But a bit of a hike, but I made it. And uh, I'll do a little bit more exploring and then head back for the evening. And then we'll call it day one of Bodrum. Day one almost finished. Let's go. So after doing that small walk, a lot has been going on with my time here in Bodrum. I've been spending my time walking around, taking a look at the sights and just taking everything in. And I also went on a boat trip. Now I didn't take my camera, I didn't take my drone on this because I wanted to just spend time and see it for myself. But of course I didn't want to drop the drone into the water. It wasn't going to happen, but you know, I just, I just, I was just thinking about that. But however, I did get videos on my phone and I did go and take as many videos as I could, as well as a video of me steering the boat. I was actually, I was steering the boat. It was all good. I was actually doing it, but I was under supervision as well. So that is all good. And now um, I feel like I'm a little bit burnt or I don't know, a little bit tanned, but it will take a little while to sink in because I always just burn normally back home. So this isn't too bad. It's not a bad thing. I'm not complaining about that. It's all okay. As well as that though, I also got a Turkish haircut, a fresh haircut. There we go. Not too bad. Nice and fresh, but also they put wax on my cheeks. And I had no idea and they ripped it off um, and that was a little bit painful and they put wax in my ears, ripped it out, both ears ripped it out. They never told me about that. I didn't know about that. I should have done my research, but I feel cleansed, you know, I feel good. I feel cleansed. <laughs> I talk nonsense, man. I talk so much nonsense. Now my time here in Bodrum has been special because it is time for myself. It is time for me to reflect and just look after myself and look around and take a rest and take a break. And it's been so 
nice. I really don't have any other words. It is the most relaxed time I've had in a very long time. And I just really enjoyed every moment so far. I've, re I've also got, by the way, I've also got one more day here tomorrow, one more full day. But what I've been doing is just taking in all the sights, looking around, getting the drone up, making videos, and just enjoying my time. On to the next step of the journey. I'll let you all know exactly where I'm going as well as going to America. So I'm looking forward to sharing that with you, all of you too. So right now I'm going to go and stay out of the sun because I think I'm burnt or quite, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm a bit burnt. So I'm going to look after myself, uh, talk to you all very soon. And thank you so much for watching a bit of how I just enjoy my time. And thank you all so much for tuning in. Paka, ispasiba bashoya, idasadanya, spasiba.